Okay, here is the new Masterpiece Blackout. I just picked this up at my local Target. So here's a look at the front of the package with a nice um, image of the product. This is the MPM13 Decepticon Blackout and Scorponok. So that's the uh, front of the box. Um, let's take a look at the back of the box with uh, some nice uh, detailed images of the product. This is how it can hold the uh, Scorponok. Some uh, accessories. And uh, I'm not sure what that is exactly. Something with his hands. But that's uh, the, box, the back of the box. And let's see, the um, side of the box with some more images of the product. The other side with the uh, image of the, the blackout in alt mode. Let's see the top of the box. <coughs> and the bottom of the box. So now, let's uh, open this up. This is exciting. So, let's see. Open this up. See what it looks like. Uh, let's pull this out. Okay, so this is uh, what it looks like inside the box. It's uh, probably some accessories wrapped up in some toilet paper. What's a little crooked there? Let's see, you get the instructions manual. This is a pretty big instructions manual don't need that. Let's just take a quick look at the instructions manual. Um, yeah, this is, um, wow, this looks uh, pretty involved uh, instructions. Wow. Let's see, and there's a back also. Hmm. And then uh, Scorponok. Yeah, it's, um, looks like this is a pretty involved uh, transformation, but let's uh, fold this back up and then now let's uh, see if we can carefully open this box here. Um, I don't know if I have to do this side. Now let's turn it back around. Let's take this out. And this should be able to come out. And make sure there's nothing else in this box. You don't want to accidentally throw something away. Okay, it looks empty. And now let's see if we can uh, kind of adjust him. Okay, so here is Blackout. Let's 
get a closer look at them. Starting with that head. That's a really, really nice blackout head. Look at all that detail. Eyes painted red. It's a little yellow highlight. Some silver. Look at that chest. This um, is very, very impressive. All the detail, I mean. Look at the attention to all the detail they put here. This is truly a masterpiece. I mean, look at this. I mean, there's just detail all over the place. The yellow outline on the window, the vents there. Look at all the detail here. This is really, really a masterpiece. And then let's see the legs. Look at all this detail. Let's move this arm up so you can kind of look at even the hand. This is really a masterpiece. Look at all the detail on the leg also. foot. This is truly amazing. Right, let's just take a look at the side and the back. foot, even the bottom of the foot. Okay, now let's uh, just kind of play around with some of the articulation here. This head, this head does go up and down, turns. Uh, there is a little side to side. It's kind of cool. Arms go out. Look at that nice ratchet. You know, I'm kind of wondering why they did not make the Megatron and Starscream uh, with all these nice ratchet, because those two have trouble uh, with stability. Look at this. They even have ratchets on the arm. Swivel on the hands some articulation in the hands, fingers, and then let's see his uh, hip skirts here, they do kind of go up and down, slide, let's take a look at his legs, open that up, there is a swivel, waist swivel, is there a ab crunch? Well, I don't think there's an ab crunch, but look at this. You do get some nice more ratchets here on the legs. Leg swivel. And obviously you get two soft ratchets for the leg. The foot. It's an ankle rocker. And it does uh, have a soft ratchet to go up and down. So this is a uh, really nicely articulated. And let's see, there's probably some other stuff here like these uh, fans. Yeah, this is really nice. And then let's see, his uh, blade here does have an open feature. Not sure what that's for, but man, even look at all the detail on here too. This is really, really nice. 
these do uh, kind of fold up if you want. Okay, and let's see his accessories. Gets two guns, two of the same guns. So this is nice. Nothing fancy about that. Then you got these two um, flame parts here, two different kinds. Really nice. And then let's take a look at uh, Scorpionok. <laughs> so this is uh, really nice. Can you articulate this? Uh, just on a ball joint for all of the legs. So not can't really articulate it too much. But you can't in his arms. What they just kind of. Yeah, you can go up and down a little bit. Is his claws open? No, his claws do not open. But here is Scorpionok. So this looks really nice. Okay, so let's just uh, look at uh, a quick look at uh, Blackout. <laughs> 